Hey guys, my Vernon Kid here. Uh, for everybody out there, happy Halloween. <laughs> uh, so today, um, channel surfing, and <laughs> as usual, you channel surf and you know nothing's on really, and you know all of a sudden you just ah what the hell just turn to a channel and watch and just see what what this or show or this movie is about. Bottom line. So I'm sitting down watching a movie. I turn to Showtime Beyond, one of Showtime's other channels. And this movie, I look at the title, says Crush. And I'm like, oh, you mean the movie with Alicia Silverstone and Carrie Elves? I like that movie. Cool suspense thriller like that. And I'm like, no, this, this is not it. I don't remember this. And I'm watching this movie, and I'm like, okay, we got a kid, and he's, he sees this beautiful woman sitting by the pool. And so I'm like, okay, so this we probably know where this is going to go. And, and lo and behold, yes. It, it does go where I think it's going to go. Uh, the guy has a girlfriend. The girl that he, he saw at the pool comes in. They have sex. And everything starts getting there. Then this person becomes obsessed over this guy. And starts basically trying to ruin this guy's life in a way. Just so she to prove that she loves him. So I'm like, uh, typical uh, movie like this. Let me change the channel. Right? <laughs> well... And wrong. All of a sudden, I, me and Malcolm, Malcolm's like, turn back, turn back. And I'm like, nah, man, it's typical stuff. This is bullshit. I ain't going to watch this. And, you know, I, I turn back. And then I'm like, you know, eager. I turn the channel back. And I'm like, okay. And we start to see more and more of this. And we start to see. So I'm starting to. I'm like, okay, I'm kind of interested. I like suspense movies, um, you know, trying to solve the, the mystery, excuse me, and stuff like that. So this guy is pretty much cheating on his girlfriend. and But all in all, he keeps waking up almost like he's drugged or something. Like he's like losing strength. He's not sleeping well or anything like that. He's having these very elusive dreams. And we find out that this guy is baby uh, is house sitting. He gets a job house sitting for wealthy families, and we're and and all of a sudden uh, we find out more that this guy is an international student. Basically, he he goes to school in the University of West Australia. So I figure out okay, this is an Australian movie. Cool. I like international movies. So I sit down, so we then we start to really get involved. And then it starts getting twisted, more twisted. The the this girl named Anna, who looks strangely like a young Rose McGowan, constantly is telling coming into this guy's room, you know, the whole nine yard of obsessive, you know, lover, you know, tell me you love me, say it, you know, choking him and things like that, and you know, and you're like, okay. The usual stuff. We've seen these movies, right? <laughs> well, the more and more it gets into it, you know, he loses his girl, his original girl. He loses his his uh, final exam paper, disappears. He loses his championship because he's also a champion in Taekwondo, so he had to face uh, defend his championship. He loses that. He loses everything. And so next, you know, he goes to one of the owner's neighbors. He calls the neighbor, actually. He calls the house owner, and the house owner is like, so how's the house doing? And he's like, it's fine. Uh, your niece basically came by, and he's like, and the guy's like, my niece, my niece is right here with me. And she said her name was Anna. And he gets, he flips out. He's like, how dare you use that name? And... There's your clue right there. One clue, like something is going on here. 
What is this? And later on, he meets Anna, this mysterious Anna again, right? And he's like, you know, what's up with you and your dad? I know you're not his nephew. And she goes on and says, we don't have a good relationship. He remarried. My, he remarried. He left my mother for another woman, things like that. So, okay, we're still like, but still, you're, you're obsessing over this guy. What, what's the deal? So finally, this guy actually goes to one of the neighbor and, in, and he starts to, he asks his neighbor, you know, you know, what's going on? And he says, I'm, they didn't tell you, you know, there was a murder in this house, basically. Dun, 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 clue. There's a murder. Uh, they, a woman broke into the part in the house and threatened the owners with a knife to give them everything. And she died in the pool. She drowned in the pool. And I'm like, okay. They never said who the woman was. So, dude goes on the internet. And uh, he pretty much looks up the incident. And they say, they show the victim's face. Who do you think's the face, guys? The mysterious Anna. And that's where the shit hits the fan. That's where everything starts getting a little bit crazy. And it goes from being the suspense to the suspense horror thriller with the mesh of Alfred Hitchcock and Stephen King mixed into it. And from this beautiful woman comes this almost like ghostly figure where she shows what she truly looks like. And you see that, yeah, she drowned in a pool. Her skin looks like it's been absorbed and soaked of chlorine. She, the, 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 and she's choking this guy and like, you said you love me and she's licking his face. And me and Malcolm turn to each other like, what the hell? What, what is this? And we're just like, okay, what is this? She, she's chasing him with a knife and things like that. Show yourself you love me by cutting yourself. And I'm like, whoa, okay, <laughs> this is going crazy. And, and, I'm like, I'm glad I turned back. This is what happens when you channel surf. And I'm like, dude, bro. I'm like, bro, what is this? And the woman who played Anna in the makeup, the ghostly makeup, she looked freaky and a little creepy. Like, her, she had these big, like, psycho eyes to begin with. But when she had the contacts in her eyes and everything, the the the, the chlorine soaked skin and things like that, she came off really creepy. And she, not only is she she's stronger than this guy, she's throwing projectiles at him. And I'm like, okay, what is this? Once again, and the movie ends with basically him dying. And I'm sorry to spoil it for you guys, but it was like, whoa, what is this? And <laughs> I'm just blown away of what I saw, just channel surfing. That's what happens when you channel surf, guys. Um, so if you are interested in the movie, uh, it's called Crush. It came out in... It's... It's about two years old. It's an Australian uh, thriller, which actually is pretty good. I, I'm not gonna. I don't care what the American critics say, but it actually had me glued to the tube because I was watching it like, okay, whoa, you, you know. But um, yeah, that was what happens when you channel surf, guys. Uh, very much. So I'm going to leave you guys with that. Just So if you ever want to check it out, it's called Crush. Not The Crush. Crush. And uh, this is Mom Vernon Kid. Peace. One love. Stay tuned. Be safe out there. Happy Halloween, guys.